It's time to take a look at this morning's movers and shakers. Oracle CEO Larry Ellison says, do the math. He testified in Oracle's suit against SAP. Ellison says the German firm SAP stole about $4 billion worth of software. SAP admits that one of its units illegally downloaded Oracle programs, but says the real value was only about $40 million. In just a few moments, we're going to be speaking with one of the top-ranked analysts on Oracle. We're going to talk a little bit more about the effect of the trial on Oracle stock. Well, here's a Paul Volcker's short-term forecast, high unemployment and slow growth. The former Fed chairman and current presidential advisor said in Beijing that he sees no quick fix to the jobless problem. He also says the outlook for limited increase in economic activity for the next year or so. The man who blocked out the World Series games for millions of TV viewers says it was the politician's fault. News Corp's COO Chase Carey cut off baseball games and Fox shows such as Glee in a dispute over cable vision over fees. Carey said the problem was that the government wasn't clear over whether or not it would intervene. That, he says, led cable vision to think it might get better terms if it held out until regulators jumped in.